Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Beyond the Math Man. We back again here at the Muscle Farm Gym. You already know what it is, man. We're going to hit some legs today because my legs is lagging like ever. My legs is lagging, bro. When I say my legs is lagging, they lagging. And I, when I mean lagging, I mean like the worst. This, this, this is what I mean right here. 25 and two in Call of Duty, right? Your shit lags so hard, the connection is lost and you pissed as fuck because you don't get your points. That's how hard my legs lagging right now. Like for real. So we're going to demolish some legs, hit some volume, hit just mad sh for the legs today. So that being said, you already know what it is. Body goods, the body analyzer scale, 60% off. Use code aftermath. Use code aftermath. You must grab this scale. You must grab this scale. Don't worry about the phone. Just grab the scale. Bone, water, body weight, and muscle mass. All right? Look at that. Boom, boom, boom. You gotta grab the scale. 60% off. Code will be below. Before I forget, Breath of Yokai is finally sold out. The first batch of Breath of Yokai is sold out. Appreciate all of you for grabbing your orders. Thank you so much. And once again, be ready for the next batch. I'll let you guys know. What smelling salts do is it enhances a reflex trigger with, uh, around the muscles that control your breathing. So you get a adrenaline boost before you're doing a PR or if you just need to pick me up in the middle of a workout that's pretty much lagging. Um, I know football athletes use it. Uh, powerlifters, of course, you see use it. And it's, um, it's just something I've been using for a while. That's why I kind of like get pissed off when I forget about it before I do a big lift. So it's really good for a pick me up. Uh, do be careful about it, you know, because it can, it can knock you out. You know what I'm saying? Like if you take a big, you know, whip, you want to be careful. You just want a slight lid on the cap, slight uh, raise on the cap and sniff. You don't want to just open it up and put your nose in it. So I'll make a, I'll make a video about how to use it properly, but. That being said, let's kill some legs. Make that air drop, girl.
So a lot of you is gonna comment and stuff, hey, you know, tomorrow, what's your rest time, what's your rest time? Um, I'm gonna be totally honest, I don't have a rest time for you guys. I don't have a time where I'm like, all right, I need to be done. I just, you know, I just, usually after I'm my set, I'm just kind of like waiting around, waiting around until I feel like I'm good enough to go, you know, full on on my next set. Like I don't have, all right, you know, one minute, one minute 30. You know, some workouts, you know, I'll try to give myself a number, but majority, 90% of the time, I don't have a rest time, you know what I'm saying? Working out, I just work out. You know what I'm saying? I get it done, you know, when I get it done. Right. Um, unless I'm doing like, going for like a heavy rep max, then, you know, I try to get like a minute in between each set um, until I get to my heavy set, a minute or two. And then once I get to about 85%, I give myself two minutes uh, or so before I get to my set. So that's really it. Other than that, you know, I'm just, I'm just kind of, I wouldn't say chilling, but I'm getting shit done regardless, you know, rest time, you know, long or short. You know, sometimes, like, I could have did my set there, and, you know, I'm, I've been waiting for, like, about two and a half minutes now. You know, sometimes I could have, if I was keep doing the same way, I'd be like, all right, let me get this done, a rest time in 30 seconds, you know what I'm saying? I just, it just very, uh, it varies, you know what I'm saying, a lot. So, I don't, I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh, rest time is, you know, two minutes and 30 seconds or three minutes or 45 seconds when I don't even do that, you know? There's a lot of guys out here, you know, I ain't calling nobody out, but there's a lot of guys out here that do a lot of shit in their videos or half-ass like workout shit in their videos that they don't even do fully, you know what I'm saying? When I come in here and I make a video for y'all, I'm not like coming in here doing a half workout and then saying this is what I do for this many sets. Like, no, I actually do these workouts, so. You know, I just, I'm gonna be upfront about everything that I do. And just like I've been upfront about my eating habits, my eating habits aren't good. Like right now, I'm finding out I'm allergic to a lot of shit. We really don't know specifically, but there's a lot of shit that's affecting me. And yet my dumb ass still keeps eating the shit that's affecting me. You know, I've been bloated, intolerance, allergies, whatever. I got rashes and shit all over my body, on my legs and shit you know, from like dairy or soy or whatever, like I'm having all these allergic problems and I still like, that's how like stubborn I am and with food and I need to quit that. I need to build better willpower for sure. So right now we got the Dorian deadlifts, four sets of eight. With the Dorian deadlifts, Dorian Yates deadlifts, you don't hit the floor. So as soon as you go like to the shin, you go right back up. One, two, three, glutes, hamstrings, Lower back, lower back. Working all that muscle. Get that contraction. Still come up. Squeeze that butt. Get that squeeze. Back down. That stretch. Squeeze. Stretch. Squeeze. Eight reps. We got last set right now. Hamstring glutes are screaming, but it's good. I think I've been lagging on my hamstrings lately. Usually it's my quads, but now, now it's my backside. Whew, I'm gonna get this last set in. Working that grip strength too. Those Juji. GHR right here. Back in 24 hour Royal in Dallas, in Dallas, Texas. I used to do it just like this. On the pull down machine, bring that down, put my knees on the pad, fall down, four sets of six. Right after, I would do a quick like 20 yard dash right after. And a 24 hour Royal, there's plenty, there's plenty 20, 20 yards, which for a fact. Make sure y'all grab that body analyzer skill yard and don't lose this chance. All right, with code AFTERMATH. Link could be below. Also, what video would you want me to do next? I, I wanna start asking you guys, what video, you know, what, guy, what, what type of videos do you guys wanna see? Uh, and I'm probably like, I'm at that point to where the exercise videos aren't enough really anymore. So trying to start going into, 
you know, daily life. I know a lot of you guys want to see what I do. It's been like that, but I've done it in the past. The videos don't do really good, and I don't really like to waste time. But um, I'm, I'm trying to transfer over into that Max Tuning, Christian Guzman lifestyle with, with, with more, more, more workout, at least, you know, in the videos. But, you know, just a little bit of life, lifestyle stuff, and uh, kind of what the hell I do on my boring ass days. So maybe it'll give me a, us a reason to go out and do shit. But I feel like we said this before and we still don't do nothing. But make sure you hit that look, like, subscribe button. Catch you guys later. Damn, I fucked that shit up. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny.